How's it going everyone? Welcome back to part 2 of Star Ocean First Departure R. So last time we left off, we just got finished protecting the town from these bandits. And hopefully this time we can get a little further into the story. So Millie's waiting for us. And let's see morning, what she Roddick. wants. Dorn already went inside. Hmm. Hey Roddick, the captain's waiting for you. Captain? There's a captain? I thought Roddick was the cap. His This old man is not the captain. There what? Are, <laughs> there you are, Roddick. <laughs> uh, you made us you all can't be proud here oh. yesterday. Repelling a bandit warlord with only the three of you, they tell me. The townspeople That's right. wanted me to give this to you. Here, take it. Is it the Rona because the way you're coughing? I wouldn't be surprised. Oh, blueberries. That that's what I get. We risked our lives protecting the town from these bandits and I get five blueberries? And he said that's a gift from the whole town? This town sucks! Oh, also some twice cooked pork. Thanks guys, five blueberries and a piece of pork. What the Hey, this is Roddick's favorite food. Why does he get special treatment? <laughs> Cause he's the main character? Shut up, Dorn. It came from a fan of Roddick's. Uh, that's all I know. Mm. <laughs> well, regardless, keep up the good work, all of you. It's not like we get stuff like we had yesterday very often. This town would be perfectly safe even if we sat on our tails all day. Dorn, knock it off. Right, Dorn, shut up. So, uh, I'm trying to eat that twice cooked pork. What's up? Oh, <laughs> is it in my items? There it is. Oh, actually, I will save that because that gives us HP back. If I'm ever in a bind, I can have that strong piece of pork and those blueberries. No. I don't know what I'm supposed to do from here, but, oh, this is Dorn's house. Cool. Wait, does Dorn live alone? Like, his whole house is just one bed. Huh. That kind of sucks. Where's Dorn's parents at? What do you have to say, little girl? Did you try the- Oh, she made the twice cooked pork? This is Roddick's fan? <clears throat> Thanks. So you're the little chef who made this for me. Thanks, Sheena. Aw, that's nice. Oh, if you guys are wondering why everyone has tails, like monkey tails and pointy elf ears, it's because this game doesn't take place on Earth. It actually takes place on this planet called... You know, I'm not even going to try to guess because I don't remember what it's called, but it's a um different planet. And these... I don't remember what their race is called either. Let me not even try to guess. But I know that... um Maybe it'll say it in here. Yeah, Fellpool. So they're not humans. They're Fellpool, which is pretty much humans just with tails and pointy elf ears and they have magic I think so um don't worry about like not getting too much variety because as you saw I'm not sure if you noticed from the last video when I showed off all the characters we can pick from but there's a, a lot of different races and types of characters in this game because um we don't go to too many different planets but every Star Ocean game is about space travel so we won't be on this planet for long. <clears throat> and we'll, we'll see a lot more than just Fellpool later on. Um, <laughs> I'm going to be honest, I didn't even read what she said, but I cheered her up, so cool. Actually, I might be wrong about that. I think in this game, most of the party is Fellpool. Because I know, I know you, there's space travel in this game, but compared to the other games, I don't think you go to as many planets. I think we only go to a couple different ones. Four, you go to a lot of different planets. Three, I think it's only a couple also. Um, like I said, I don't really know anything about two. And Star Ocean 5, you only go to one planet. That game, that game, I don't like it. <laughs> but if I ever do a playthrough of five, which I might consider if this playthrough does well um, then you guys will see that where am I supposed to go <coughs> sorry 
they didn't really say what my object objective was. They kind of just said, um, I'm the captain, you're Roddick, here's some food, have fun. I kind of like and dislike that about older games. Um, that they don't give you as much direction. I like it because some games, like, are too much with the tutorials and everything. Like, they try to hold your hand a little too much. But, um, also some games don't tell you what you're supposed to do at all, like this one. But, might as well head to the next town while I'm here. I don't know if they'll let me do it this early, but there's a town not trouble. too far away. And Roddick is back alive. Perfect. Um, oh, I forgot to check if I have any skills right now, but I don't think I have any yet. For now, I just gotta attack with my sword. But you get a lot of really cool skills throughout the- Dog, you got slept that quick?! By some dogs?! Oh my god! Open your eyes! It's because he's never looking! Oh, there we go. Shockwave Swirl. We learned our first skill. Let's go ahead and equip that right now. L1 button. Actually, I'll make it, yeah, L1. Shockwave Swirl. Well, now we have a skill. Cool. And this is a bridge. <laughs> cool. Interesting. And there is the town. I think if I go here and go back to our hometown, another cutscene will play. Everyone ready? These guys again. They don't know when to quit. Block that. Block that. Block that. Y'all can't hit me. Oh, oh, oh. That's what I get for talking crap. <laughs> right when I say y'all can't hit me. Of course. Of course. Oh, I didn't even show off my new skill. Next, next fight. I'll use shockwave swirl. Cool. What's going on with this town? This is the village of cool. Mount me. Matorx <laughs> is just north of here. I'd advise against visiting that dangerous place. Man, you don't got armor like me. Watch out. <laughs> nice music here. What's up with this guy? Did you guys come from Kratos? <laughs> we didn't even answer. <laughs> yeah, we did. Wish it was tomorrow already. Me too, kid. Me too. What do you think daddy's going to bring home this time? Oh, their dad must be out at war or something. A necklace. Nice. What's up with the mom? My husband's coming home tomorrow. He's been away for the last six months due to work. Oh. Not war. Work. <laughs> well, don't worry, kids. You'll see your dad tomorrow. And what's going on here? Old dude. The young folk just keep leaving this village. What's going to happen? Uh, I read that a little wrong, but don't worry. I do that sometimes. <laughs> Still get the gist of it. 200 bucks! I kind of stole that, but I'm not going to say nothing. <laughs> Sorry, old man. What's in this chest? Blueberry. Man, blueberries are everywhere in this world. Most of the men from this village have left to make money somewhere else for their families. Is that why it's only old people, children, and women in this village? Huh. Well, this is kind of a sad village. There's like three houses and no one's here. That's tough. But sounds like tomorrow a lot of these working men are about to come back to their families, so... <laughs> Maybe? Let's head back to Kratos for now, though. We're not worried about that. Um, I think tomorrow, like in-game, not tomorrow, in real life, I will go visit that town again and see what's up with the dad and all that. And see how everyone's doing once the men return. Ow! punks. I really like the um, graphics in this game with like the sprite work. Like obviously it's not anything crazy like other games but the sprites themselves are really cool looking. And it doesn't look bad. Because lately I don't play a lot of like sprite games like this but honestly this one looks looks pretty good. <laughs> I don't know why it brings you into a whole cutscene just across that bridge. That was weird. And another fight. Look out! Everyone ready? The, again, <laughs> the way they're holding their swords. We're not gonna talk about that. Ugh, and their little mustaches. Dang, I don't even need Dorn. No wonder Roddick's everyone's hero. Oh, I still didn't use my skill. Next time, next time. No, hold on, let me get into one more fight just so you guys can see what it looks like. 
He just does a little spin and a bunch of energy comes up. I'm pretty sure that's Shockwave Swirl. Aw, oh, you're not gonna make me kill some bunny rabbits. Come on. Mm. And that moves really good for when there's multiple enemies. Now, in this game, the basic attacks are alright, but you really want to spam your skills because the more you use them, the stronger they get, and sometimes they can evolve. So I think Shockwave Swirl can turn into like this Phoenix move where he summons a flaming Phoenix and it like flies around him and does way more damage, so. Definitely gonna try to keep using those as much as possible. Let's see, maybe I have to talk to the captain again. Oh, yep. You called for us, sir? Ah, Roddick. Good to see you here. We've got <laughs> trouble. Take we always have trouble. A letter came in earlier. A letter? Send help immediately. Mystery outbreak in Cool Village. Residents suffering from high fever. Suffering from a fever? Cool village. We were just in Cool Village. What could have happened in the last two seconds? What? So what do we do? We go help them out. That's what. The herbs that grow on the peak of Mount Maytarks ought to do the trick. Wait. Oh. Father. Millie's dad. Leave this matter to me. Martoth, will you go on our behalf? Yeah, Martoth. Yes, I don't. <laughs> you go get the Rona. They have the Rona. That's what the. The, the virus is in Cool Village. Oh no, we're yeah, you go you got that, <laughs> Millie's dad. Well, if the best healer in all of Kratis is on the job, it'd be a tremendous best healer. relief to all of us. <laughs> He's probably the only healer, <laughs> but okay. <laughs> Actually that's not true, sure Millie is. While, all right? Stay away from Mount Maytox. It's too dangerous for you. Oh my god, everyone, Mount Maytox is dangerous. Stay away. Yeah, right. We're definitely going to Mount Maytorks. I don't care what nobody says. Well, I'm off. <laughs> Have a good night. Yes, sir. We'll let you know if anything's up. Come on, guys. Lighten up a bit. Millie, I know how you feel, but Roddick, you've been acting weird lately. What's wrong? You can tell us. Roddick has been acting weird lately. <sighs> Roddick, what's wrong, bro? Two days! I honestly don't remember <laughs> anything from the beginning of this game. Father still hasn't come back. I've got to find him. You're not going, all right? He said he'd call us if he needed us. Oh, her dad's still not back? But, but I can't just sit around and wait anymore. Roddick! He definitely What's caught the Rona. A powerful disease has struck cool. My methods are powerless <laughs> against it, and even worse. I thought he was the strongest the healer in the world or something like that. Myself. He Animal got the skin contact He caught the Rona! To spread the illness. It incubates for about an hour, but after it develops, the infected turn into stone in about three days' time. Oh. There is no hope for cool. Do not approach it under any circumstances. Martoth, Cleet. Oh. Millie. <laughs> Do not approach under any circumstance, Millie. Yeah. So are we? What? We're not about to let them just die over there from the Rona. Well, um, next episode we are going to head for Cool. We were literally just over there and they were chilling, but I guess now they are in trouble. So. Um, <laughs> hopefully we won't catch the Rona, we will see, but that's going to be all for this episode, 
thank you guys for watching and um, make sure to like comment and subscribe if you want to see more and look forward to part three catch you guys later